आज ही डाउटनेट ऐप डाउनलोड करें डाउटनेट पर होगा अब आपके सभी मैथ्स केमिस्ट्री फिजिक्स और बायोलॉजी डाउट का सफाया बस अपने क्वेश्चन की फोटो खींचो उसे क्रॉप करो और तुरंत वीडियो सोल्यूशन पाओ डाउनलोड नाउ इन मास होवर्स क्लास द रेशियो ऑफ बॉय टू गर्ल इज एक्स टू वाई इफ द टोटल नंबर ऑफ चिल्ड्रेन इन द क्लास इज फाइव टाइम्स द नंबर ऑफ बॉयज इन द क्लास एंड एक्स एंड वाई आर इंटीजर्स विच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग कुड बी द सम ऑफ एक्स एंड वाई ऑप्शन वन नाइन ऑप्शन टू टेन ऑप्शन थ्री इलेवन और ऑप्शन फोर ट्वेल्व नाउ द क्वेश्चन स्टेट्स दैट द रेशियो ऑफ बॉय टू गर्ल इन द क्लास इज एक्स टू वाई सो लेट एस एज्यूम दैट द नंबर ऑफ बॉयज इन द क्लास लेट एस एज्यूम दैट द नंबर ऑफ बॉयज इन द क्लास इज एक्स इन टू सी एंड द नंबर ऑफ गर्ल्स इन द क्लास इज y into c where c is a constant a positive constant and c is not equal to 0 okay so that the ratio of the number of boys to girls remains as x is to y so now the total number of students in the class will be given by the sum of the number of boys to the as uh, the sum of the number of boys and the number of girls so that will be given as x into c plus y into c now this is the total number of students in the class however the question also mentions that the total number of children in the class is 5 times the number of boys in the class so as we know that the number of boys in the class is x into c we can equate this to 5 times the number of boys which is 5 into x into c Okay, so now this equation can now be written as taking this x c to the right hand side of the equation, we can write y into c equal to five x c minus x c, and this comes out to be equal to y into c equal to four into x into c. now as c is not equal to 0 we can cancel c from both sides of the equation and finally we have y equal to 4 into x now we have the relation between x and y as y equal to 4 into x so the sum of x and y which has been asked in the question can be written as x plus 4 into x, as in the place of y, we can write 4x, and this is equal to 5 into x. So the sum of x and y can be written as 5 times x. However, the question also mentions that x and y are both integers. So the sum of x and y, which is equal to 5 into x, will be 5 multiplied by some integer, and it should be divisible by 5 so finally we can have a conclusion that the sum of x and y should be divisible by 5 now the question asks us which of these four options can be the sum of x and y so we simply have to check which of these four is divisible by 5 so option number 1 is 9 which is clearly not divisible by 5 so this is not the correct answer option number 2 is 10 which is divisible by 5 as 10 by 5 is 2 so we can pretty much confirm that this is the correct answer but however we check for the other two options option 3 is 11 which is not divisible by 5 and similarly option 4 as well which is 12 is not divisible by 5 so of these four options only option number 2 is divisible by 5 so we can confirm that option number 2 is the correct option क्लास सिक्स टू ट्वेल्थ से लेके नीट आई आई टी जे मेन्स और एडवांस के लेवल तक 10 मिलियन से ज्यादा स्टूडेंट्स का भरोसा आज ही डाउनलोड करें डाउट नेट आप या व्हाट्सएप कीजिए अपने डाउट्स आठ चार सौ चार सौ चार सौ पर